Sumie is East Asian brush painting, the same kind of painting done in China, but it's, for, it's a Japanese term. And it means basically writing with ink, but it's come to be known as painting with ink. Artists are the only people that really see things because you have to see things clearly and in detail in order to paint it. You may not paint it in detail, but you may, you need to understand it. The, co the concept of the object, how it was formed, how it works, how it moves, and so forth, before you can actually paint it. I'm trying to capture the energy and sort of the life spirit of the object, no matter what the object is, whether it's a bird or a plant or a flower or a rock or a mountain. And there's energy in all of these things. Well, this, this is a finished painting of a lace cap hydrangea. And you can see these flower-like red petal objects. They're not actually flowers. They're, they're false flowers. And they're, their function is to attract the bees. So it's a very nice uh, arrangement for the hydrangea and the bees. You're inspired by nature itself. And you know, nature is a commanding presence wherever, wherever we go. And once you look and see and look cl closely, uh, you, see you see different things that you might want to capture. This is a lotus with a, lo a lotus leaf, a lotus flower on the top, and two stems. This is a young leaf being formed. There's a little dragonfly on this branch of, of, of the grass, the wild grass. A statement in calligraphy together with my name in it. But the statement says, the ink painting evokes the scent of the lotus. One of the interesting things about the painting is that it's all ink, except for some tones in the uh, petals of the flower and, in, and the color of the, of the uh, dragonfly. The uh, rest of it is just various shades of ink. When you're involved in a painting, you're not always happy with what you're doing. And it's only at the end, and if it turns out right, that you, you get some pleasure out of it. You know, they say that you learn from your mistakes. And I learn a lot when I paint. <laughs> 